Hello everyone, welcome back, buckle up, because today we're taking a cosmic road trip touring the mesmerizing landscape of Starfield's planets, as revealed in last weekend's Starfield Direct. We've got some breathtaking views, wild terrain, and plenty of wow moments to share. So sit back, relax, and get ready for a spectacular journey. Our first stop is at the enchanting planet of Aquila. At first glance, it's strikingly beautiful, but the moment it pans up to that mountain, it's an absolute jaw-dropper. The realism in Bethesda's design instantly floods you with awe and wonder. Then we have the serene yet somewhat unsettling moon of Al Patani 5A. It's a contradiction, eerie yet peaceful, a stark lunar landscape punctuated by a looming celestial body. It's not a place for an extended stay, but certainly worth a pause to soak in the unique view. Next, we drift to the planet of Charabidis 5. The ringed planet is a spectacle to behold. It's got a feel of authenticity to it, more tangible than what we've seen in games such as No Man's Sky. Al Garab 3B offers a stunning contrast. A moon bathed in the glow of a setting sun through whispering palm trees. The terrain feels familiar, solid, giving a sense of place you could really touch and explore. The harmonious colour palette of Cassiopeia 4A is an absolute treat. The terrain, sky and gas giants complement each other perfectly. Freya 9B is a stark contrast, a moon that seems harsh and inhospitable. The terrain is uneven, the atmosphere thick, almost choking might not be your vacation choice. Welcome to the Jurassic-esque moon of Groombridge 8A. It's serene, it's not a bit sparse, but offering a peaceful getaway. Sur Ma 1, with its challenging terrain, reminds me of a No Man's Sky planet. It's not the most welcoming spot in the galaxy, but its uniqueness is undeniable. We find beauty in solitude on El Chibar 10B. This moon and its stunning landscapes make for an idyllic spot to set up a base and take in the sunset. The stunning lighting on display throughout our journey is an absolute feast for the eyes. Who else is itching to explore Jemison? The planet itself is enticing, but the lure of New Atlantis makes it irresistible. Then we have some beautiful displays of planetary geology and weather systems, from volcanic activity to beautiful reflections and diverse climates. We certainly can't forget about the breathtaking views offered by Poroma 4C, Neymaria 4A, and Sumati. These diverse landscapes are begging to be explored. Lastly, there's an enticing element that we've not yet seen in similar games. Canyons. The mystery they hold makes them worth a detour. Starfield has thrown open its doors to a universe filled with diverse biomes and vistas. Every planet, every moon, offers a unique experience, a sight to behold. It's a visual spectacle that has left me awestruck. Every new vista feels fresh, unique, and something to look forward to. I'm thrilled to see what other secrets and wonders the universe of Starfield has in store for us. Don't forget to drop a comment below with your thoughts and share with me the wow moments you had as you watched this Starfield Direct. If you enjoyed this video, remember to hit that like button and subscribe for more Starfield content. Until our next cosmic journey, stay curious and keep exploring.